Hey guys, welcome to another Forza Horizon 2 gameplay video. Today I'm just going to do you a quick test drive. This is the car I drive most when I'm doing online races and online road trips. It's a Nissan Skyline R34. It's got 900 and... I'm not actually sure how much power it's got. It's 900 and something. Hold on, let me just check. So it's got 928 brake horse, so that's a 2002 model. Um, full roll cage fitted, big wheel, basically everything that can be done has been done, yet it still stays in the class S992 I think it is, class, to drive, so I can still drive it. Now, it isn't the quickest car you think it would be, but it's just not, but it's great for things like drifting, and when you're doing online races, let me just turn the volume down a little bit, you need to be able to get your back end out, get your arse end, a bit of arse end fun. Sounds wrong, but you know, that's what I call it. When you're drifting, as you can see, it just turns. Because people seem to think if you win races, you're going to win like the whole tournament, but you don't. It's all about your driving style. So getting your back end out and drifting is going to get you more points. So I never focus on being first across the line, I just go for driving style, even if it means coming last in every single race. That is what I do. Some people think it's wrong and you have to win. Well, you know, that's the way you play it, that's great. But I don't. The whole point of the game is driving and enjoying yourself as well. So anyway guys, hope you're all having a top day. It's Saturday, so the weekend is here. Hope you're all going to uh, have a good time this uh, weekend. Hopefully the weather stays good. I'm in England at the moment, in Manchester, and the weather is pretty decent at the moment. But apparently we have got rain coming. So as you can see the car's done in my standard. All the cars I use for online racing are usually matte white with a black carbon bonnet with the Total T sign on the bonnet, like a vinyl decal. If you don't know, Total T is just my business. It's um, We print t-shirts and whatnot, clothing. And there's enough about that, that's kind of boring. But there's the car. As you can see, it's not the fastest accelerating either. You don't need it. So, if you're enjoying the video, could you hit the like button? That would be awesome. Please like, share, or subscribe if you don't mind. That would be fantastic. And that's a, that is the video, really. I just wanted to do a quick, a quick drive of this car because this is the car I drive most of all, and I've never really done a test drive or a review of it. I say review. I've never shown it you guys, so hopefully you, uh, you like it. And if you do play this game online, please look me up. My name is Stevie Bentley. Send me an invite. Um, my driving crew, my Forza club, should I say, is SBYT. And there's me crashing. I'm going to throw this up here, do a quick UI. Not too sure about the speedometers on most Japanese cars like this on the go up to 160 kilometers. 160 is only. What's that, about 100 miles per hour? I'm not sure, to be fair. Oh, sorry, 180. 180, which is about 115. Don't get that. Surely people drive faster than that in Japan. Move your car out of my fucking way. Thank you. So, guys, thank you for watching my video. Like I say, this is a Skyline R34 GTR. 9 to 8 brake horsepower, 4 wheel drive. And that's it, I guess. So, thank you for watching. Please like, share, subscribe if you don't mind. And I'll check you all soon with another video. Hope you have a great day. See you soon. Bye-bye.